I'm so excited I fixed the time machine, you guys. Oh, yes. How? Oh, what did you do? I did something different this time. From now on, whoever touches the button, that person only goes back in time. Not all of us, just the person that plays You know oh. what's going to happen. <laughs> we all know what's going to happen, don't we? Love it. Yep. Mr. Marker. Hi, guys. Hello. So excited. I finally got the time machine fixed. Fantastic. Finally, get back to time. Hopefully, to some markers here and learn how they taught Shakespeare the Dragon to read. Just don't touch the button until we're all ready, Mr. Marker. Yes, That's don't. Button. Please don't touch it. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you. I hope you guys can help me. I'm looking for Lake Park Key. You found it. Fantastic. Uh, I'm on an adventure. I, I had a team, but they kind of left me behind. It's a story for a different time. But anyways, I'm searching for Sir Marker. Sir Marker is here. here. Is it true that he taught a dragon Shakespeare how to read? He, he did. did. He did. Shakespeare's here too. Oh my gosh. Can you guys introduce me to them both? Absolutely. Absolutely. Come, Come with me now. now. Welcome, stranger. I am Sir Marker, and these are citizens of Lake Park Keep. What brings you to our humble castle? Sir Marker, it's so awesome to finally meet you. Uh, my team and I have been traveling through time trying to find you to ask you this question. Myth says you taught a dragon how to read. Shakespeare, I believe, was his name. How did you do it? A dragon. A great question, and a grand adventure indeed. Shakespeare has been marvelous to all of us, but you know what? I think I will let the citizens of Lake Park Keep explain to you how he learned to read. Grit! We keep trying even when things get tough. Grit! We teach our kids that too. Amazing! Responsible decisions! We can control the choices we make. We are healthy, safe, and respectful. Responsible decisions! That was, that was a, a big, big one, one for Shakespeare. Problem solvers! We set goals, we take risks, we take we stay, stay focused, we don't stop until we're proud. He taught Shakespeare to be a problem solver. Oh my goodness, we teach our students that also. Growth mindset! We do not give up. We learn from our mistakes. We practice. The harder we try, the more we learn. Growth mindset. That's another one we teach our Panthers. Crazy, we do the same things. Well, there you have it, Mr. Marker. That is how our Panthers, our residents of Lake Park Keep, taught Shakespeare how to read. I hope that answers your quest. And good journey to you, sir. New friends, this is such an amazing day where I've learned all these secrets. I have a real sense of belonging at Lake Park Keep. And it's a good thing because I believe I'm stuck here. My steam powered time machine didn't make the trip to the past with me. You know nothing, Mr. Marco. I can cast a spell using this crystal ball that will take you back to your own time. Legend says this was powered by reading. It is powered by reading. However, I can cast a spell, but you'll have to get up to 88 miles per hour. How do I do that in this time? Dragons! Whoa! Oh, must be getting close to 88 miles per hour. Keep going, Shakespeare! No, but I hope he learned his lesson. Well, if the time machine's still here, how is he going to get back? That was quite a king's landing. <laughs> Guys, I found Sir Marker in the past. I know how he taught Shakespeare to read. It was all about what we still do for our Panthers today. It was SEL pieces like grit and growth mindset. And wouldn't you know, even back then, the little boys and girls showed Shakespeare 
about their kindness, their respect, their responsibility, and their being ready to learn. And he learned how to use those qualities, and that was all part of his learning to read. So they do what we do. Wow. Awesome. Sorry you guys didn't awesome. get to go with me. I guess the time machine didn't work right. It worked exactly the way I planned it to work. <laughs>